Hey everyone, Big Papa Volpeg's back with part eight of our Last of Us playthrough. So the museum did not quite turn out as expected. Another dead firefly, and we lost Tess. The closest thing to love we've come to know in all this chaos. So now it's up to us to deliver Ellie to the fireflies all by ourselves, but we do need some help first. Let's see if our brother Bill will welcome us with arms opened. Now let's get into it. <laughs> Obviously, I'm in such a hurry. No target. I repeat, no target. There's a soldier over there. Doctor, how the hell are you breathing in this stuff? I wasn't lying to you. You spot him? No, place is empty. I'll check out this area. Check over there. All right, so take two on my stealth. Let's see if I can get his dumb ass. I'm gonna find you. He's gonna turn around, I can smell it. Step into the light. All right, man. Two solid stealth kills. That's good. We'll take it. Now we're just going to check around, see if we see anything yummy. If I'm like running past like good stuff like um, pill vials or ammo or you know just general crafting items, let me know. It's been so long. Okay, so I'm pretty sure the path would like me to go that way. Now this reminds me of NJ Transit. Hey, uh, I can't swim. We'll figure something out. It's okay, Ellie. We're just exploring for a minute.
Now, Ellie, you can't swim. Can you run up here? Oh, I remember this part of the game just a little bit. I think I remembered, like, <laughs> drowning because I didn't know how to resurface. So we're going to practice that once or twice before I uh, go buck wild. Okay, so the puzzle here is I have to remember how I get up there. I know I have to get up there and then ride the trains basically like up to that exit. Okay, I don't think it's that way apparently. Check over here, see what we can find. Cool beans, okay. Right, Ellie, can you just hop a little bit over here, please? A little hoppity hop. down here. Hey look, it still works. Smuggler's note. Your contact is a dude named Frank. Remember Frank? He's the guy on the outside I've been trading with. He wants into the Boston QZ. Meet him in the Park Street exit of the subway station right by the Capitol building. Attached is his visa and QZ papers. You like that handiwork. Be careful down there. Some of my guys are reporting clickers and stalkers in the area. Where the hell is this guy? I've been waiting here for over two hours sweating bullets. I keep thinking I'm seeing something moving in the shadow. Feels like a stalker is going to jump all right so now i gotta worry about these things called stalkers huh you're not gonna leave me here right okay just stay put I'm not going anywhere now before I go down that way, I'm just going to take a few minutes and check this area out here. What's down this way?
it all. Really? Really. Okay, okay. Be careful. I got it. Now I forget, can I actually knock her off? Before I go down this way, let me. Well, let's just see. Is this just a. Let's get out of here. I really want to see what was down that other way. So this could be either a big payoff or be completely stupid. Or it could be a nothing burger. Let's see. Surface. There you go. And pay off it was, people. Come on, go down. If you're just joining us, Big Papa Bullbags here. We got Jay Marone in the chat, just hanging out, doing his thing. We just like to kind of keep things chill. Feel free to chime in, say what's up. More of your average kind of explore gamer. Not really in too much of a rush. Like to explore things. It's my first time playing this game in a long time, so you may have heard me say this once or twice. things gonna play out you don't bring up Tess ever matter of fact we just keep our histories to ourselves secondly don't tell anybody about your condition they think you're crazy they'll try to kill you and lastly you do what I say when I say it we clear sure repeat it what you say goes Good. Uh, now there's a town a few miles north of here. The fella there that owes me some favors. Good chance he could get us a car. Okay. Let's get a move on. Now there we go. It'll be faster to go through here. Man. What? Nothing. It's just... I've never seen anything like this, that's all. You mean the woods? Yeah. Never walked through the woods. It's kind of cool. <laughs> Why 
Why don't you just take me back to Marlene? If she was up to the task, why'd she drop you off on us? Well, maybe she's better now. Kid, I don't mean to upset you, but your friend's chances of survival weren't too high to begin with. She's a lot tougher than you think. It don't matter. Because I doubt I can get either one of us back into the city in one piece. Trust me. I wish there were some other option. Oh, hey, buddy. why you check your corners people you never know what you're gonna find I love it how they make this place like overly cute and safe feeling with all the little animals running around Now the path wants me to go up to that door, but we're just going to keep walking around a little bit, see what we can come up with. In the comments, if there's anything I'm missing, let me know. Fireflies. I mean, real fireflies. Yeah, I see that. Sorry. So the thing is, I don't know what gap they're talking about yet. Oh, you know what? Maybe they're going to tell me to go up in here and let's see. Let me get up here and I'll get a look. Ooh, what's this? Oh, sweet. We'll take it. Melee upgrade. Improve any melee weapon to kill enemies with one hit. The upgrade has limited use. It will break off when its durability is depleted. And it requires all these goodies. Okay. How old is this particular game? You know what, man? I do not know that off the top of my head. I would say that since this is the remastered and it originally did come off on the PlayStation 3, it's definitely got some time. What about this? If you do know how old this is and you're in the comments, please uh, feel free to type it in there, man. There we go. Now, before I go across this uh, son of a gun, I'm going to just check on this because I'm pretty sure if I go up here it's going to tell me that this is locked and that that's the path I need to go but I figured it out before the puzzle like presented itself This is where he lives, but no, I ain't never been here personally. And that smoke, you think that's him? Sure as hell better be. Well, let's go check it out then. Right, come on. Ever since we had our little talk, Al, I think we're getting along a lot better.
Down here. Let's watch your step. It's a good drop. <laughs> So $64,000 question, is this like one of those circumstances where I could totally avoid this guy, save some ammo, and feel good about myself? What is that? Or should I be stupid <laughs> and mess with him? <sighs> My gut is telling me to be stupid. Before I do that, let's just... Face? check over here and this guy's tucked away all nice and good What? Oh. See, it pays to be stupid. I got three bullets out of that deal. Okay, we're going to go in there, but we're going to check over here first. After Ellie gets out of my way. So is it more worth it to just try to be all stealthy here? Or is kind of my tactic of kind of being overzealous and... Uh, You know, high difficulty, high rewards, the better choice. Come here. Are you all right? I'm trying to learn how to whistle. You don't know how to whistle. Well, does it sound like I'm going to whistle? We'll take it. Okay, and we're just going to pause it for a second so the bolt bags can go on a quick pee break.
thank you for holding everybody I just had to go and take care of some business so now let's see reminder collect more pills see if I can scrounge up some extra ammo I only have three weeks until the next drop off with the Tess Oh, I forget if you dick around too much in this game, I think it'll like be like, all right, so you realize that you need to do this, right? Yes, I know. I am just taking my sweet ass time because I like to scavenge a little bit. Okay, so sue me. Let's see. Okay. Oh, shit. It's jammed from the other side. Here, boost me up. No, that's not such a good idea. Well, I can't boost you up. How else are we going to open it? All right, let's go. Foot. Uh, now just open it. Nothing else. Sure thing. For those watching, uh, give me a follow. It doesn't really cost anything, but uh, means the world to my little heart. Okay. Ta da! Good job. Thank you. I still got a lot of meat left on this thing. I don't know if I'm going to want to cash it in yet. I think I want to blow all the rest of the uh, stamina this weapon has. So let's see we get a car from this buddy of yours. Then what? Well, then we go find Tommy. Marlene said he's your brother? And more importantly, he was a firefly. He'd know where to take you. Okay. He lives far from here, which is why we need the car. Hey, look! <laughs> gnomes! Yeah, those are gnomes. Man, I had an art book filled with these. I always thought they were super cute. <laughs> Not fairies, though. They creep me out. Alright, man. Pretty neat. Now, keep progressing this way. Am I missing something back here? Did you play this before? No. But I had a friend that knew everything about this game. Apparently, there's this character called Angel Knives who'd... What was it? 
She'd punch a hole through your stomach before kicking your head off. Uh, I'm never a big fan of these things. I wish I could tell you. One day, Ellie, you will be able to play it again. See, this might not be the most exciting because I'm not just kind of running through the game. But at the same point, look at all this cool shit I'm finding around here. Like all these extra little pieces of scrap and whatnot. You know, in a game like this, you know, it definitely does take its influences from, you know, where Resident Evil came from. So, scarcity, you know, really is paramount. And, um, you know, just by kind of painting your corners here. Evacuation. Evacuate to where? What do you think? Quarantine zone. See, some places got a heads up before the infection showed up. Most didn't. Man, must be hard. Just leaving all your stuff behind like that. That ain't the hard part. All right, so now it's going to kill me if we don't find this. But um, there has to be some kind of a paper or a note with a combination on it. Yeah, that's Bill's handiwork. Anybody else live in this town? As I know, it's just him. So I want to see if we can find that note. Oh, shit. Jesus! Whoa, Nelly! What, what the hell was that? That would be one of Bill's traps. Your friend a bit paranoid, maybe? No, that's putting it lightly. What's the deal with this guy? Well, he helped us smuggle stuff into the city. He's, he knows how to find things. Let's hope we don't blow up trying to find him. Just watch your step, you'll be fine. <laughs> watch my dumb ass, like, totally fall into one of these traps. And I am doing good on the... reservations there. Oh, yep, there's a trap. Money, money, money. Okay, if I were a note, I would be in a place like this. But apparently not. <clears throat> Alright, so if I die... See that wire? Stay underneath it, okay? Just keep your head low and you'll be fine. <sighs> Alright. What? made it look like so much less cool. Printer notes. Goddamn infected showing up much too close to the church safe house. Looks like I'm going to need another round of clearing out the weak spots of the perimeter.
All right. Hey, Jay, I'm in a music store. You think they have any Ibanez? Do you got the PV? You got the PV in here? If anybody knows where the uh, combination might be, uh, <laughs> if anybody knows where the combination might be, please feel free to chime in because it's going to be one of those things that's going to bother the heck out of me. Where the heck could that damn thing be? See, that's the money. And I need to go in here. Now, the one place I haven't gone. I don't think I've gone up this way. Is this the place with the arcade in it? If so, yes it is. Yep, we don't want this place. I didn't go too far back in here. Maybe there might be a... another secret place back here that I just got overzealous on and left. not there. Yeah, this is where I was before and there was this little spot which I mean after me walking all the way back total nothing. Jay, I hate to say this, man, but I don't know if it's going to be very entertaining for me to run around this place looking for this uh, safe combination. How about we just blow it up? anybody's watching and knows I want to save volt bags a little time I would totally appreciate it oh is this it come on baby note to Bob oh I think that's it Bob, I'm not leaving town without that safe. Help Brad load it into the pickup in case you need to get in. The combination is 5, 17, 21. Ooh. Yes. So for visual reference, everybody, it's right there on the fence. The one place. Oh, sorry, Ellie. I didn't mean to whip at you. I'm running around here like a... I have no idea what's going on. And meanwhile, it's right there at the fence. I think it's that reluctance to... wanting to trigger the next section. Ah. Oh. Hey, sorry about it. I don't know what just happened there, but looks like the stream cut out for a split second. Probably just Twitch being Twitch.
Does anybody think I can make it in the ASMR world with my manly like voice? What are you doing, buddy? Pick it up. I want to place it right up here. <laughs> what are you doing? There you go. Alright, bro. If you hit me with a booby trap, I am not going to be a happy camper. Oh what yeah. Is that? I'm a pretty good shot with that thing. How about we just leave this kind of stuff to me? Well, we could both be armed. Cover each other. I don't think so. No, actually, I love this thing because I believe you can reclaim it uh, up to a few times if you need to. So every time you shoot an arrow, you can just kind of pull it out of the clicker's head or something. At least that's what I remember. That was sort of anticlimactic. Okay, we're headed. All right. We're heading to that smoke. <sighs> Looks like we need to find another board or something, Joel. Down the ladder. There you go. Here. I can actually use this. No. Put it down. Come on. Okay, I'm just going to move you down a little bit further so that you stop trying to pick it up. There you go. Shit. All right, we're going to test out these um, bows and arrows. Let's see how this does. Let's give this baby a whirl. Listen, Bill ain't exactly the most stable of individuals. So when we get there, you let me do the talking. You understand? I understand. You got to be clear on this. You, you don't take too kindly to strangers. All right. Bill's a good guy. He just... 
definitely need some time warming up to you. That's all. Oh, I guess that means I lost my pipe bomb. I guess you uh, can only carry so much. All right. So far, everything's looking okay. Spidey senses are not tingling. <coughs> Tripwire. Ellie Duck. You hear that? Yeah. see what we can find you're gonna find my body when I die from a heart attack don't worry I got this what do you think it's gonna be Jay Marone could it be a kitty kitty Shit out of me. Well, while we're here, let's, let's search the place. Rich. Yeah, this bow and arrow is the beast. Okay, note to Rachel. Rachel, soldiers are going door to door, forcing people onto the buses. I hear yelling, a couple of buildings down, time's running out. I tried calling, waiting. I don't know what to do, but I can't wait anymore. I've thrown most of our stuff into a couple of suitcases and I'll be waiting for you in the quarantine zone. Come and find me. I'll see you soon. Ezra. You think they ever found each other? How the hell would I know? Well, I'd like to think they did. Oh yeah, pills are very good in bathrooms. I feel like whenever you're searching these like desolate homes, you can always find something pretty good in the bathroom, like pills or whatnot. Here. Stand back. All right. Oh, shit. Those things are kind of 
Awesome. That's one way to do it. Okay, so now I gotta do this again. <coughs> Come on, Ellie. No trespassers. Well, we're gonna we're gonna test that, you little turd. Like, look, I have, like, like, there's no way to, that you could just reload these things, huh? Cool. Just stay close. Nothing down this way. Let's go and check back in and go through this door. I got you. Damn it, Bill. What just happened? Another one of Bill's stupid traps. There, that fridge, it looks like that's a counterweight. Okay. that rope and it'll bring me down on it that was such a well engineered trap Joel shit here they come Joel you stay under the rope I was gonna say, how are you still standing? Come on. Hey, Tom, Ellie. Hold on. You all right? Yeah. Come on, you can do it. At this point. Yeah. Catch. Thanks. At this point, why don't you just shoot the rope? Damn it. Come on, hit her. Come on, dude.
You're not gonna get it. You're not gonna get it. and all. Uh, Ellie. Hey, what are you... Joel? Bill. What are you doing? Bill! Turn around and get on your knees. Just calm down a second. Turn around all right. and get on your knees. Don't test me. Just take it easy. Any bites? No. Anything sprouting? Oh, God damn it, I'm clean! If I see so much as a trick. No! Stop! Son of a bitch! You done? Am I done? You come into my house. You set off all my traps. You damn near break my shooting arm. Who the fuck is this punk and what's she doing here? I am none of your goddamn business. And we're here because you owe Joel some favors. Oh. You can start by taking these off. I owe Joel some favors. It's some kind of joke. I'll cut to the chase. I need a car. Well, it is a joke. Joel needs a car. Well, if I had one that works, which I sure as hell don't, what makes you think I'd just give it to you? Huh? Yeah, sure, Joel, go ahead. Take my car. Take all my food, too, while you're at it. By the looks of it, you could lose some of that food. You listen to me, you little shit. No, fuck you! You handcuff I me. need you to shut up. All right? Whatever favors you think I owe you ain't worth that much. Actually, Bill, they are. Well, it don't matter, because I don't have a car that works. But there is one in this town. Parts. There are parts in this town. Meaning that you could fix one up. All right. I'm going to do this. There's some gear I'm going to need. All right. It's on the other side of town. Now, you help me go gather it, and maybe I can put something together that runs. But after this, I owe you nothing. That's fine. A couple days from now, we'll probably be dead anyway. Good. Follow me. Whole goddamn town's booby trap. Best stay right on my ass. Can't miss it. Knock it off. All right, we're going to end it here for now. Although things got off to a bit of a rocky start, Bill appears he'd be willing to help us secure a vehicle for the journey ahead. We just have to pick up some nearby supplies and the mission will be over. Or will it? Please subscribe so that you don't miss part nine, which will be coming out real soon. And if you'd like to be part of the action, make sure to follow me on Twitch at Big Papa Volt Bags. Links below. Catch you on the next one. Peace.